What's going on you guys, this is Austin with United Exterior Cleaning in Austin, Texas. Um, in this video, I wanna make it really short and sweet, and that is how to set up a garden hose reel on your pressure washing rig. Um, after searching on YouTube, I could not, surprisingly, I could not find one, not one single video on how to set up a reel that has a garden hose that feeds your pressure washer. So very surprising, I couldn't find any information on that. Um, so I figured I might be the first one or maybe the, maybe there's another guy out there that would show you guys how to do it. So without further ado, this is a general pump hose reel. If I were to take this off, which is the locking mechanism, take all this hose off. I'll show you what you get. Pardon this, a couple 50 foot extensions. Okay, so when you buy a general pump hose reel, you get a couple things. One, obviously the reel. Two, you're going to get this little piece in here, this little fitting, and it comes with a little spring on it. Now, this little inlet is going to have a little uh, metal 3 8 fitting that would be for a high pressure uh, option, but you're going to go ahead and screw that out, and you're going to put this fitting on there. You screw that in there, you're gonna need some pliers because this thing has a little uh, swivel in it. So you're gonna to wanna to take some pliers, hook up to this, screw your little hose on there, and get this situated in there. Now, there's a couple different ways to do a garden hose reel. Uh, some of you guys may not like this option, but hey, this is the option that I found out was easiest and until proven wrong or until Otherwise, this is going to be the option that's going to work best for me. So that's not needless. That's needless to say. I might switch it up in the future uh, if this ends up going bad on me. So for right now, I'm going to use what was provided for me, which was this option. So you're going to go ahead and screw that on there. Now, the other thing you're going to get when you buy a general pump hose reel is one of these little 90 degree elbows, which is going to be for this. So this is a half inch fitting these are half inch elbows as well so you're gonna what you're gonna need is a half inch to uh three quarter or five eighths barb whatever your uh garden hose is so for instance my garden hose is a five eighths uh flexzilla so what you're gonna do is you're gonna screw on this piece the elbow that you get with the reel do this with one hand i'm not gonna do it all the way i know i'm gonna need some teflon tape which is which is one thing you're gonna need for this is Teflon tape, but just for show, I'm gonna not use Teflon tape. You're gonna screw that in there. Here's your little half inch to five eighths barb. Screw that in there. You're gonna wanna use Teflon tape. So it's gonna look like that. Okay. Now, this is the garden hose that goes from the pressure washer. As you guys can see, the garden hose is hooked up down there let me swing around so i can show you what we got going on on the pressure wash side garden hose is just screwed directly into the rig now there's a filter in here which is going to stop some debris from going in there and there's also in this little fitting that comes with the uh, general pump hose rears, there's a filter in here so you got two filters um that's going to filter and uh filter out you know all the debris and any kind of silt that comes from those um, you know, these, these spigot systems. Um, so that's going to work for me. I know in the future, I'm going to get a, um, uh, what you call it, a buffer tank. That's all coming in the future. But for right now, guys, this is what we're rocking with. Um, so anyway, you got the half inch to five eighths fitting in here and you can pick these up at a, uh, Home Depot, Lowe's. Uh, I went to my local pressure washing store, uh, here in Austin. They supplied me with one. They're a couple bucks. Um, anyway, you want to put one of these little clamps on it. Boom, like so, and go ahead and stick that on there, like so. And there you go, that's your rig. That's what I'm rocking with, easy enough. This plugs into the spigot, water feeds the truck, goes into this little fitting here, out the half inch, uh, 90, 90 degree elbow that comes with it. Into, ooh, into a half inch to five eighths barb, or if your hose is three quarter, you'll wanna get a half inch to three quarter barb. Screw that in there, hose comes directly on here and feeds the system. 
So hopefully that was uh, easy enough for you guys to understand. Brought some kind of value for you guys as far as what kind of fittings you're gonna need for setting up a garden hose uh, reel system for your rig. So um, if you guys got some value from that, please like and subscribe, throw down a comment. Peace.